Welcome back to another week in my life vlog, days in my life vlog. I don't really know what this is going to be, but I just got home from work and I have a ton of Black Friday and Cyber Monday packages already. Literally just walked in the door with these packages and it's the first thing I'm doing. Out of everything, I definitely spent the most money on my Abercrombie and Fitch order. I feel like they never go on sale and I had 30 and then an extra 15% off on top of that. So I got this fun green blouse and then I got three bodysuits, dark brown, black, and then light brown action. And pretty much all of them are square neck. I got three different pairs of pants from Abercrombie, um, two jeans and one leather pair. I thought it was about time that I tried their Curve Love collection. Anyways, that's it for our unboxing segment. I have a lot of stuff that I just want to like pick up and do laundry and clean a bit throughout the apartment because since tomorrow is the start of a new month, I just wanted to kind of like reset, do a December reset, if you will. Sometimes I like to hike up mountains just to see how crazy small we are. Still bitching about your problems, can you fall apart? Baby girl, the liquid out your eyes rolls right down to the source of your life. Obviously, the next day, just pulled my K cup out of my advent calendar. Rainbow, the reindeer blend, cherry and decadent dark roast coffee from Caribou Coffee. So, Popping that into the Keurig right now. I'm using my gingerbread oat milk creamer from Chobani. If there's one thing you can count on, it's the fact that I probably will be using a Chobani coffee creamer in my coffee for the foreseeable future. I just love their stuff. And with that, I'm gonna hit the road. Day one, and I'm already messing this up because I didn't even do a taste test from home. And I have taken a couple sips of this on my drive to work, but so pleasantly surprised. I'm feeling the Christmas spirit for sure. Good morning, you guys. It is Friday morning, and I'm just throwing on some foundation before I head out to work. Um, still need to make my coffee this morning. I ended up having a late night yesterday because after all of the cleaning and like laundry, I stayed up late to upload a YouTube video, which is up now, thank God. So I'm just glad that that is over and done with and out in the universe now. Anyways, that is literally it for my makeup foundation and mascara because I can't be bothered to do anything else. And I think it's time we open the advent calendar for the day. Oh, Kahlua. And of course, can't forget to switch out the Christmas countdown. But this is exciting. Is this not an alcohol brand? I'm unsure what the morals of having a Kahlua flavored coffee before work are, but here goes, I guess. Can't have that much alcohol in it if it's in a K-cup, right? Now that I'm smelling the coffee, maybe I am in trouble. Eh, maybe that's the fact that it's like not even 7.45 in the morning, but 
I don't think that one's hitting. All right, hi. So I actually got let out of work half an hour early. So it's only 4.45 right now. And I'm in the Trader Joe's parking lot. I spontaneously decided to come over here to get some groceries for the weekend. But after this, it is Friday night. I'm having a chill night. So one of my friends is coming over. I think we're gonna watch movies, just hang out. Well, I hope you guys like hauls because it turns out that this whole vlog is just one big extended Black Friday and Cyber Monday haul. This literally looks insane. These are both huge, but I got two different winter boot options from DSW and then my winter coat from Macy's, which I guess they packaged in this giant box to keep from squishing it which I appreciate because it was originally very expensive, but um, I had store credit, so did not pay that much for it, thank God. Oh, and how can I forget? I ordered a sweater from Anthropology. Someone take my credit card away from me in the new year. Um, you're not allowed to take it away from me now because I still have a couple Christmas gifts to buy for people, but like in the new year, no shopping for me. Because this is, uh, I'm embarrassed at this point. All right, um, it's been a little while. Victoria is here and she is getting a live unboxing of my winter coat. Um, oh, this is like heavy. She is long. Oh, she is very long. Let's see. The sleeves may actually be short on me. Hmm. Do I have long arms? It's got like a vest within the jacket. You're right. Like this yeah, yeah, yeah. Zipper. Like there's a second zipper that ends right here. I also don't like. It's like extra work to. It's just weird because zip up the levels, coat. Like... Yeah. Yeah. Look at this giant hood. Yeah, they're really similar. So that's why I was like, I want to try them on and then decide on which one to keep and which one to return because I definitely don't need both. Good morning, you guys. It is actually Sunday morning now. Um, I'm watching World Cup soccer. Poland is playing against France, and unfortunately we are losing two to zero, so it's not looking good for us. But I was just not in a vlogging mood yesterday. I did, however, film me unboxing my Keurig advent calendar in the morning, which was really good yesterday, like a Pete's Coffee Big Bang. I will be repurchasing those K-Cups, I think. They were delicious. And then last night, Victoria and I did go out downtown, got some drinks, ice skated at Maggie Daly Park. So I vlogged a couple clips of that and we just had a good time, which is why my voice is sounding a little hoarse this morning, but thankfully I'm not hungover. But I figured it was time to pick the camera back up since I am about to open up my advent calendar again this morning. I need some coffee in my system. Day four. Oh, little holiday blend. Green Mountain Holiday Blend. Is no! Oh my god! Fred's just scored again! <sighs> Not me acting as though I know anything about soccer because I don't, but like, gotta represent my blood. Also, if any of you are confused, I am Polish. My parents were both born in Poland. Um, Polish is my first language, went to Polish school growing up. I can still speak Polish. So I wasn't born there, but I tick off every other box that applies. After this game officially ends, I think I'm gonna make some French toast this morning. I don't know, that just sounds so good today. One point for Poland. We managed one point. Ugh. I wish I could say I had a productive morning and afternoon, but I really didn't. I'm dressed now, wearing this like oversized brown Princess Polly sweater, and then my new Abercrombie jeans with the rip, and my new shoes from DSW. I'm going to the mall to make some returns of the stuff that I'm not keeping from all of my Black Friday orders. Yeah, so walking through Macy's just now, I'm already regretting my decision to come on a Sunday, but 
cross your fingers for me. The goal is to only make returns and exchanges today. Maybe get a Christmas gift for my cousin. this video and this was actually supposed to be two different vlogs but I changed my mind I'm making it one big video so this is just like the beginning of the other vlog now so I'll send a follow-up almost 11 a.m. I'm eating a very late breakfast. I'm working from home this week, but this morning I had two calls back to back. I have some errands I want to run during my lunch break. I need to stop at the bank and go to Walgreens, um, all of which is walking distance from my apartment. So I think I'll just try and get some steps in and then immediately after work, I am going to cycle bar. Okay, hello. I came back from Cycle Bar, showered, ate dinner. My plan for the next hour of this night is to reorganize my closets. My closets are crying for help. I never had a good organization system in the closets and when I brought all of my like sweaters and winter clothes over from my parents house everything hit the fan the last thing I see before I go to bed and the first thing I see when I wake up is just like my messy closets and like all the clothes that are overflowing onto my dresser over there which I'm not going to show you right now because it's embarrassing this closet isn't as bad it has most of my work clothes in here but my jeans <laughs> need to be refolded. I'm gonna put in some white strips and turn on a Kenzie Elizabeth vlog and just get to work. You're the drink, the capsule in the bottle, the damsel in the dress. You come to save me from distress. Stay the week, distract me from my problems. The Finally finished my closets and cleared off my dresser. So I am feeling good. If I even try to purchase any clothing in the months of January or February, please bully me in the comments. I don't need it. I don't need the clothes. Good morning, you guys. My coffee this morning was like a chocolate mocha from McDonald's, the McCafe K-Cup, and it's not that good. It smells just like a Swiss Miss hot chocolate, which gets me so excited, but then it just tastes like coffee that went wrong. So I'm thinking, because I'm also craving a bagel with cream cheese and I don't have that right now, I might do a little online order at Dunkin', run over, grab that and an iced coffee, <laughs> and then keep working. I am getting my hair done after work tonight. I just need to like touch up my roots, add some more blonde in there. So um, thankfully I was able to squeeze in an appointment right before the holidays. Okay, hi, I'm on my lunch break now. Um, just on my couch, had a sandwich. Um, Unfortunately, my Dunkin' today tasted like dishwater. Like, you know that thing on TikTok where people are like, Dunkin' either hits or it ends up tasting like dirty dishwater. Unfortunately, it is number two today. So I'm zero for two for both of my coffees today. I did not finish the other one. I simply couldn't swallow that. I have been meaning, and I need to get rid of my drying rack and put it away, but this wall over here where my bar cart is, 
I've been meaning to get like a poster here and I saw one on TikTok actually maybe like last week. This girl from Chicago designs little posters and I have been thinking about this one for the last couple days and I've decided I'm going to like buy the digital download and then print it at Walgreens and frame it myself. So this is what I'm getting. It just says too busy creating my dream life and it has a little like disco ball black and white. Maybe I can even like pick it up today and then stop at Target on my way back from getting my hair done. <gasps> this is happening. Okay, time jump. Um, it is like 5.15 and I'm heading out to get my hair done. Just kind of through my little, uh, what, what is this coat called? It's like a trench coat, but it's winter. Threw this on over my sweatshirt and leggings and added these boots, just trying to kind of like elevate the look. I don't know. Exactly. Amazing. Thank you so much. Okay, out of my hair appointment. My hair is looking much blonder now. Clearly, I'm in the picture frame section. I thought I wanted to get like a lighter wood frame, but the closest thing they have is this like brassy gold one, which I don't really love. So I think I may go for black. This feels really big now that I'm holding it, but my wall is 34 inches across and this is only 20 inches across. So there's still gonna be plenty of space. And my poster print is ready to pick up at Walgreens once I get home. So an exciting night in the books. Okay, hi, I'm home. I have the giant frame and I picked up the print from Walgreens. It looks fabulous. It printed so well i'll link it down below or like i'll link the girl's etsy shop in case you guys want to check out what other stuff she has but i'm just so excited about this i love it so much it just fits so well it's a little large but I don't think that's bad. I never really ended up eating a real dinner, so I just had a bowl of cereal and I'm calling that a day. Anyways, I don't really have any plans for tomorrow, which is Friday. Um, so I'm thinking I'm gonna pick the vlog back up on Saturday. It's just gonna be another boring work from home day for me. So I'll see you in two days. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. It is actually sunday morning now i thought i was gonna vlog on saturday but i ended up going out friday night and then um was a little hungover so you didn't really miss much but it is bright and early i just brewed my advent coffee of the day and i'm headed to get my nails done because it is time to kind of fill in a little i might get a similar red color and on top of that, my thumb, unfortunately, my nail broke. So um, that is the plan for today. And then I'm seeing my parents and um, need to stop by Sephora to get some Christmas gifts. what I want because I had like a very Christmas red this time. Yeah. Okay, um, success with the nail appointment. I ended up going just a little darker than last time, like a cranberry red, but just felt very fitting for the holidays. I ended up stopping at Dick's to get two Stanley Cups. Um, they are Christmas presents for my cousins. I don't think they watch these videos, so hopefully this doesn't get spoiled for them. I figured it would be a good thing to give as a gift because um, I'm pretty sure neither of them already own Stanley Cups. So I got a blue and a gray one. I think this color is exclusive to Dick's. So, um, that is gonna be part of their gift and then I'll get the other part when I go to Sephora later. And then um, I wasn't sure 
if I'd be meeting up with my parents today, I thought I was going to drive over to their house, which is an hour away, but it turns out that my mom has last minute plans with a friend of hers who lives closer to me. So I'm actually just going to like meet my mom here in the area, but I need to go grocery shopping in the meantime. And I want to like reorganize my bathroom. Now that I've reorganized my closet, my bathroom cupboard could use an update as well. Thank you. And then also a half a pound of Munster cheese. Okay. Thanks. Um, sorry, I only am updating you guys from my car today, but it's simply been an on-the-go day. I actually just met my mom in a Mariano's parking lot. Gave me some documents that I was needing for my parents, and then also gave me like a little bag of homemade food. But she was on her way to like a holiday party with her friends, and I actually uh turns out i'm not going to sephora but instead i mean i'm still gonna place an online sephora order today the timing just didn't work out with when stores closed but one of the envelopes that my mom brought me is actually a gift card from my work bonus. I got a Visa gift card from work as like an end of year thing and like a thank you for this initiative that I was part of. And on top of that, we have this like reward system where you can like earn points and you can convert those points into gift cards as well. And I have been saving my points and waiting for this gift card so that I can finally buy myself a new laptop. And that is what we're going to do today. I'm gonna to go to Best Buy and get a new MacBook. Um, this has been, this has been years in the making because I've been complaining and talking about wanting a new laptop for forever. My current one like still functions, but like it is on its last thread. So that is what we're doing today. And I'm going now because they have like holiday deals on MacBook Airs, but yeah, surprise. <laughs> Uh, okay, so not only did I just buy a new laptop, but I still have time to go to Sephora because it doesn't close for another 35 minutes and that is all I need. <laughs> Okay, so I'm back home now and I figured we would do an unboxing. Um, this has probably been one of my most expensive vlogs I've ever filmed considering I got my hair done earlier in the vlog. Did my nails this morning. I mean, that was only like $35 and it's a new habit I'm trying to start. Um, so we'll see if this continues into the new year. And then obviously my Sephora and laptop purchases. Let's just say I uh, will not be okay the day that I do my like year-end financial review, but figured I would show you what I got at Sephora first. So uh, for my cousins that I got the water bottles for, I also picked up some like Laura Mercier little gift boxes for tinted cheek moisturizer. I'm just going to combine this with the Stanley bottles and that'll just be little gift right there. Um, got some more Peace Out Acne Skin um, Dots for myself. And then I restocked on my foundation and concealer and primer. Technically, I'm not finished with my current foundation from Rear Beauty, but I really like it and I figured I could buy it now while it was 20% off and it'll probably just 
sit in my newly organized cabinet for the next month or so before I have to open this. And then for my concealer, I lately and for the last couple years have been using Tarte Shape Tape, but that is exclusive to Ulta. And so I just asked the lady helping me if she had any recommendations and she suggested the Huda Beauty Concealer. And then as my final item from Sephora, I haven't had perfume in forever. Like I don't even think I have a single bottle of perfume at this apartment and I wanted to change that. I love a good like rain water scent. That is my jam. So I got the Clean Reserve little mini size of their rain reserve blend. And this is just something that I'm wanting to become more of a habit in the new year. And then of course, the laptop. I am so excited, you guys. I don't know if I'll be able to like fully set it up tonight because I have to buy a new external hard drive for it, but it doesn't hurt to do a little unboxing. This is the 13 inch one with the M2 chip. And then I got the 512 gigabytes of storage because your girly uses a lot. I'm trying to make this laptop last for another nine years. I don't remember if I said earlier, my current MacBook is from 2013. Um, it would have turned 10 years old in 2023. So hopefully this one lasts just as long. She's loading. You know how people name their cars? I feel like I should name this laptop. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you guys. Um, it was an interesting last couple days. I once again spent a lot of money and um, yeah, <laughs> the Sunday scaries are hitting. All right, my heater just turned on and it's ruining my audio. So thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.